All right, welcome back, everybody. I like these. They're pretty fun, so I got some more. Not too hip on the base cards, but seem like the inserts are all pretty nice. Especially the jersey cards or the RPAs. That's what I need out here. I guess I did end up saving one pack from the last break of these. That's because the camera uh, ran out of time or whatever. The video ran out of time. <clears throat> All right, got Pete Rose. Hmm. Bryce Harper. Mariano Rivera, Chris Bryant, yeah, they're not bad looking cards really, even for the base card, Rookie Class, Colorado, Ryan Velotti, ooh these are the green ones here, uh, Elroyd Jimenez, I guess just one of them. Kyle Lewis. And there's Pete. Jimmy Fox, Miguel Cabrera, uh, Fancy Chris Bryant here, not sure what they call that, that's pretty sharp. Jose Altuve icon. Uh, Hans Hans Kraus. Uh, that's my green rookie class. Philadelphia Phillies. Corbin Burns. Milwaukee. And Goose Gossage for the Yankees. I guess him without a mustache here, it looks like. I'll see what they say about him. <clears throat> he had 124 wins, 107 losses, 
3.01 ERA, uh, 1,002 games, 37 games started is all, 310 saves, or you think for some reason it'd be more than that, uh, 1,502 Ks, strikeouts, in 1,809.1 innings. Uh, joining New York as free agent in 1978, Gossage immediately sought it in as the team's closer and proceeded to lead the league with 27 saves. He repeated the feat two years later, amassing a career-best 33 saves to once again pace the crowd helping him finish third in the balloting for Cy Young. Ooh, that's a chunky one there. We're going to save that. We're going to set that right there for the moment. shiny come one coming up got Vladimir Guerrero jr. absolute Toronto in the red uniform Randy or Zarena that's a nice one there icon Vladimir Guerrero jr. I don't think you know, got a name on that or whatever. Or if it says on the box. I don't see where it says any names in any particular parallel, but I don't know if they call it a shimmer or something like that, maybe. Freddie Freeman, statistically speaking. Uh, got a green Manny Machado. Uh, Pete Alonzo. And Mike Piazza. Features 162 card base set, including 100 base and 62 rookie baseball material booklet signatures, black and white seams, numbered to 99. Huh. Also look for these randomly inserted cards, base retail green Retail, Lava, Base Retail, Hollow Gold, Hollow Gold, Hollow Black numbered from 99. Okay, it gets to be too much there for me. There's a lot there, of course. Maybe that all is if you want to pause it and try and figure that out. <coughs> I thought maybe we'd find a like a 1 in 10 pass or 1 in 6, you know, calling things like a wave or something, but I'm sure it probably says it on it. I just figured it'd be easy to find. Hmm. Yeah, there's a lot. 
Walk the parallels. We want to save a pack, but we're going to open her all out. We're going to say we opened a whole blaster. See what we found. There's Javier Baez. Francisco Lindor. Kiro. Marcus Simeon. Ooh, there we go. Extreme Team. That wasn't my green because it didn't have even more color. I've got Josh Donaldson. He bungled the the hit. Cost him the game last night against the Red Sox. They play again tonight though, Sunday night baseball. Oh am I He's a Yankee now? That's what, okay. Yep, he's a Yankee now. Yeah, because I think he got traded, didn't he? I think that was, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what happened. So it got me second guessing myself now. All right, Cattell Marte and Ron Santo. I think he got traded to the Yankees. I'm sure that's what I saw happen last night. Got a good one on the back there. We got Ronald Acuna Jr. Got Steve Carlton. Key Brian Hayes. Gil Hodges. I think last year they used that photo, the same photo, and I think it was black and white, so that's kind of cool. Almost positive, that's why I remember. Oh boy, nap time. By storm, Alec Bregman. Followed by Alec Bregman. Got Clayton Kershaw. And Thurman. Oh, wait. That Alec Bregman was green. Woo! Alright, good deal. Don't hate the card, hate the player. He's a, he's a good player, though. He's good. All right, there we go. Come on now, baby. Last pack. We saved the fatty for last. Byron Buxton on the back there. Cedric Mullins to lead it off. Card number one. I bet we don't get seven in this pack. We'll see here. One. We got Anthony Rizzo. Ooh, here's our special card. We got Eli Morgan. For Cleveland pitching and he might be pitching against my Royals today so I'm gonna tune in and watch that game as soon as I get off here uh, all right. man that thing's chunky look at that thing compared to three 
Still got seven cards out of that pack. Tony Lazari. Uh, Hall worthy for the Yankees. At least I think Yankees. Yep. We better read up on him. I haven't really heard of him too much. With all attention in New York on Babe Ruth and Lou Gehrig, it made the job of players like Lazari easier. Often batting behind the duo during his 12 seasons with the team, the slugger picked up the slack when needed, driving in 100 runs seven times and helping win five World Series titles. There you go. History lesson this morning, this afternoon. Nice Randy Johnson there, green parallel. And there's a Tony Lazari there. Finished with 178 home runs, 148 stolen bases, 292 average, 467 slugging percentage. We'll finish up our history of lasting on him. Fielding a pair of rookies up the middle in Lazari and Mark Koenig. Many thought the New York couldn't contend for a pennant in 1926. Proving them wrong, the young duo led the team to spot in the World Series that set the tone for a dominant run in the Bronx for a second baseman who won five titles. <clears throat> Excuse me. And we got Brian. Byron Buxton. He's not having a bad season, I think. I think he's doing all right this year. All right. Hope that was a little more entertaining than the last couple of videos. Those last two were kind of depressing. I almost wanted to leave. Uh, cards were nice, so anyway. Probably just turn the sound off and enjoy it more. But, uh, thank you for watching. Um, learn that. You have a great weekend. And uh, maybe if I get time, I'll rip open another box. But it'll probably be big league. I go big league next time. Should probably stick with baseball. Try and save my football for when football season starts. Because I, I like to find some prison, but I don't think it's gonna happen for a little bit. And or series two. So talk to y'all later.